Welcome back. If you have a sweet tooth, listen up. A brand new cookie dough bar is opening on the strip today. It's called Dope. And joining me now is the owner, Kelsey Withero. Kelsey, good morning to you. Hello. Thanks for having me. Well, thank you good for morning. coming in and bringing. I mean, I have a, a, a <laughs> pretty intense sweet tooth, if I admit that. Yes. Um, and <laughs> this is like my heaven right here. We're in the same boat. Yes, it's really <laughs> exciting to me, too. Yeah, good, good. I'm, I'm glad I'm, you like it. Me, too. Me, too. Um, so tell me just how you came up with the idea for Dope. Yeah, so Dope is a safe to eat raw cookie dough bar. Um, I had a little bit of a different path. Worked in tech for 10 years before getting started with dope. Um, over that time, very high stress, and I developed an unhealthy relationship with alcohol. But in 2015, made the decision to get sober, and my life totally changed. So I kind of got back in the kitchen, got back to what makes me come alive, and I really love making desserts for people. So um, I was baking vegan for a bit, found a great substitute for raw eggs but I love butter. So it's butter filled, egg free and delicious, <laughs> safe to eat. And delicious, safe yeah. to eat. So um, like I said, I mean, this spread is absolutely incredible. Is this sort of what it feels like inside your shop? Yes, today is our grand opening. You can come check it out. We've got our dough it yourself bar. <laughs> today, I'm gonna make you one of our remixes though. So if you're not feeling super creative or you just love what we've put together, we've got five remixes to choose from. Okay. One of which is called Chiptastic. Chiptastic. So if you wanna help me out, throw in a little scoop of absolutely. chocolate chips. Absolutely, did you say little? Can I make yeah, it? Yeah, right. Okay. <laughs> we'll add some peanut butter chips. Okay. And then how do you feel about potato chips going in that? I feel good. <laughs> hey, I trust you. Yeah. I'm not going for the remix. This is this is all you. So the sweet and salty take is just delicious. And the best part is 100% of proceeds from this flavor go to the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. Okay. So we have the Stoke for Hope initiative with my company. I think with my personal journey into sobriety, I just feel driven to kind of raise more awareness to mental health and addiction. That, um, is affecting so many of us in this country, but we're also afraid to talk about it. So Absolutely. brings the conversation to light and it's pretty sweet eating it. <laughs> you started this just two years ago. How yeah. rewarding is it for you to not only be chasing your passion in the kitchen, yeah. but also to know that you, you have this whole other side of it too that is helping other people? It's pretty awesome. I mean, I, I was happy in my tech job, I guess, kind of coasting and all, but it was a career in itself. I just didn't feel like I was making much impact in the world. And now it's pretty amazing to have something where I feel like, A, we're just this bright part of people's day when they come in the store, they get to have something sweet and kind of let the stress of the day go. But with the money we're raising for nonprofits and the awareness we're raising with our Dope for Hope pledge and, and things like that online, um, yeah, it feels really good. I'm proud of myself and happy that I get to share my story more broadly. I think more people need to know that it's okay to figure out what's not working for you in your life and make a change. Okay, Take what is your, your one life. piece of advice for people? Because not yeah. so many of us, when you said coasting, that really, yeah, I think yeah. so many people can relate to just going about their lives and not really feeling what they're doing and not being inspired yeah. and not being passionate. What's your one piece of advice before I dive into this? Yeah, I think I gotta tell people to just figure out what makes you come alive and just jump and do it. Cause as soon as you get a little idea in your head, you'll wonder forever, like what if I had tried it? And you know, you only get to live once. And I just feel like your job, wherever you go for work or what you do for your livelihood is gonna be a big part of your life. So you better be super happy doing what you're doing. Um, and it's worth, uh, worth shaking up whatever age you are. Yeah. You only get one life. Um, yeah. And you know what? I am not passing up this <laughs> opportunity to dive right in. Uh, what yes. is this called again? Ch so Chip this is Chiptastic. <laughs> and you can meet the Chippendales today at Dope, 1 to 3 p.m. at our grand opening. She loves it. We got a round of applause. Mm, wow. <laughs> it's wow. pretty dope. So the Elsa, commissioner. You take us to break. I can't even. I'm just going to keep eating this. <laughs> Come and see the commissioner deem today, March 16th, Dope Day in Las Vegas at our grand opening, Miracle Mile Shops on the Strip. Congratulations. Thank you so much for being here. I have yes. a mouthful of dough and that is fine with me. More we'll news and weather coming up after the break. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Awesome. You like it? I